I'm here in Port de Pesh, a fisherman's shipyard in Monastir, Tunisia. Now this old schooner behind me might not look like much right now, but she's about to become something special. A floating hub of exploration and discovery dedicated to fighting climate change and saving our oceans. Hi there, I'm Steve. A few years ago, I was gainfully employed as a marine engineer on some of the finest yachts in the world. And for reasons I can't fully explain yet, my family and I decided to take on the wildest project of our lives. The refitting of this old schooner. The goal was to transform her into a vessel where students and scientists could uncover the ocean's secrets, fight climate change, and inspire future generations to care about our oceans. Because the ocean isn't just our planet's heart, it's our future. A schooner is like a wee city in the water. Where there are no grocery stores, no hardware stores, no coffee shops, and every resource counts. So we're gonna be getting creative with how we reuse materials, conserve food, energy, and water. Scientists and students from around the world will be joining us to explore some of the biggest questions about our oceans, and we'll be sharing their discoveries with you. Our journey will dive into the seven principles of ocean literacy, guiding us from vibrant coral reefs to powerful ocean currents, and perhaps even uncovering secrets about some of the ocean's most mysterious inhabitants. After all, who doesn't love a deep sea mystery? or even an exciting shark tale. Expect epic adventures, questionable cooking, and maybe a few accidental overboard moments, all in the name of science. Whether you're here for the adventure, the hands-on restoration, or the mission to protect our planet, there's something for everyone. So, if you're a student, researcher, or an educator with ideas on how to get involved, we would love to hear from you. So please, Leave your comments, do subscribe to our channel, and join us as we transform this beautiful old lady into a symbol of hope for our oceans.